Hi, welcome again to 5 Minute Revit. In this video, we'll see how to create interior elevation. Let's see how it's work. I have this uh, elevation mark in here, and if I click on this uh, uh, click on this uh, symbol here, I have my elevation for this side, but I can adjust that in here to see the whole the whole side of this bedroom and I select in here and adjust that. I double click. Now I have this. Uh, I have this uh, side of the bedroom for my interior elevation. I just adjust this crap region to make it nicer. Now, if I go to my graphic, I have smooth. Okay. Now it's cast the shadow. Let's uh, add some lighting that let's ambient light little bit shadow apply uh, maybe add more that's better and let's hide this and now I start by uh, selecting this element that I want to tag and I go to annotate and tag all. And now I make sure that only selected objects in current view are selected and multi tag category. And I have already this tag loaded in this exercise. I apply and now I have my uh, here elements are tagged just to adjust a little bit my tag to make it nicer and bring that tag in here to right place the same to center that little bit now i can start by adding some text note and it's easy we just do example for this uh, white pink it wall and let's bring it in here let's add arrow here for this one and arrow here for this one and add another note and name it that white tile and add escape select add arrow in that and just uh, to add some dimension in here go to align dimension you can duplicate that for example I want to make it on millimeter millimeter just for example millimeter linear and let's put that in millimeter in here maybe keep it like that apply but you can just for example you can keep it for if you have uh, inches and feet in your project you can keep it like that let's put that in here in here and in that one like that let's do that for just a example for that you get the idea now I just align the style in here. I go to modify, align, and align this one with this one, and align this one with this one, and align this one with this one. And now we have this uh, 
interior elevation you get the idea you can have you can have uh, your own standard but uh, for this purpose of this exercise we just uh, show this uh, sample to show you how you create interior elevation in a rivet to add dimension and tag i hope this video uh, make you understand the tool that you need to do uh, your interior elevation don't forget to subscribe to our channel to get the latest tips and tricks on how to learn rivet thank you and have a nice day